So as most of my lawns have really slowed up and turned to dust due to all the uh, dry weather we've had lately, I thought I would do a different video for you for a change and um, show you me pruning and just tidying up this little hedge. Uh, it's made up of ivy and honeysuckle and lots of different bits and pieces, um, but it does make up a little bit of a hedge and also a bit of an archway. Now this isn't like a normal hedge job where I would just come in and cut it all to shape nicely. Uh, being as this is made up of ivy and, and honeysuckle, that type of thing, I've got to be fairly careful that I don't cut off one of the uh, sort of main, uh, would you say, sort of vines. Um, I'm all, I'm basically just taking off the uh, the yearly growth or any of the long spindly bits and pieces. First time I cut this, the customer would let it get right out of control wasn't actually any definition to where the um, where the archway was you couldn't actually see that uh, so the first time I cut it I chopped it to bits really did uh, there is actually a fence line in there somewhere I did cut it right down uh, quite drastically but we do now probably two years later have it under control fairly well the birds really love nesting in all this type of thing so I can never get on it too early always have to wait till sort of end of July before I get to it. Uh, unfortunately some of the honeysuckle in there is flowering but the customer wasn't too fussed, just wanted it sort of back under control uh, as much as I could. This is normally a place I will come and cut the grass from every visit but as we all know over in the UK at the minute there's nothing really needed mowing at the minute. We're still going for a fairly dry patch Although, by the time I get this video up, I think it will have broken over the weekend. We are expecting a fair amount of rain, which is going to be absolutely brilliant. But I'm fairly grateful for the customer to let me come in and do a job like this. Uh, the only downside is, is um, it's just incredibly dusty. And uh, flies and bugs absolutely love you this time of year. They're all over you. But, uh, as I said before, this sort of job really, and I have done before... Um, could quite easily be done by hand. Uh, you could go around with your with your loppers and just take bits off at a time. I had a few little jobs that the customer wanted me to do on this day, so I did decide to get the uh, the steel long reached uh, combi out just to quicken things up a little bit. I get very well looked after on this job. The lady gets me a few biscuits and a coffee. And on a day like this, it's hot and uh, really, really humid. Uh, I'm going to take every rest break I can. It's important, guys, make sure out there you get plenty of drink and uh, plenty of breaks. So as I've done the hard work on this ivy archway uh, over the last few years, it, it now has become very, very easy to maintain. I literally just go across, take any of the wispy bits off. As you can see here, looking a lot tidier. I can now get through the, uh, the archway nice and clear. Thanks ever so much for watching, guys. Take care, be good, and I'll see you next time.